looking at the microgrid, navigating the fractals, every minute, every hour, a new fractal appears. On the five minute time frame, we have a typical decaying fractal. Uh, we did a trade there. 10 to, okay, okay, 10 points. Top tick, right? Now, along with the five minute time frame, we have a 20 minute time frame. A typical slider top. The 20 minute time frame confirmed the five minute time frame. We picked up 10 points on a quick trade. Okay, now you can do the technique all day long on any market. All you have to do look at the decaying fractal, look at the Decaying fractal, look at the decaying fractal, and do, you do your trade. We did limit our risk to zero, and we picked up 10 points right here. Okay? Right there. Now, how far will the decline go? We don't know until we find another fractal discovery. Okay? Uh, right now, it's about noon. A uh, lot can happen during the day. But again, the trading objective, <clears throat> uh, you're trying to get 5 or 10 points. Okay, Take the 5 or 10 points, and we can locate another fractal, whether it's growing or decaying, and we can do the trade. All right? Don't hold on the entire day. Again, you do not hold for the entire day. All you're trying to do, you make a few points and you're out. Because in another hour, uh, in the afternoon, another fractal is going to appear. And all we're doing is identifying the fractal tops and the fractal bottoms. And we execute the trade. We have our risk defined. Okay. And that's all we're trying to do. Okay. We're not going for the home run. Forget the home run. All right, it's not going to happen. Well, sometimes it happens, but uh, uh, not too frequent. All right, so all we want to do is get a, uh, a 10 point, 5 point uh, gain, and that's our trading objective. That's all we're doing here. All right, that's all we're doing here. The typical trade, okay. Uh, <clears throat> oh, this one here is about, uh, okay, maybe half, 15 minutes, half hour. If the trade is, uh, isn't working out, you exit and you forget about it, okay? And you go on to the next fractal, okay? So we had a top here, it declined. Uh, we had a top here, it declined. We have a top here, it declined. Uh, what's going to happen next? We have to wait for another fractal. Where do you find the fractals? Go to Neil's channel and he'll point them out to you. Okay, and then you can do the appropriate uh, trade uh, based on your risk and your count size. Okay, uh, you can do three lots, five lots, 10, 20. Uh, it's up to you. All right, but if you're beginning, uh, do one or two or three. Okay, until uh, you become familiar with fractals. Uh, after a while, all you have to do is uh, look at your screen and they pop up right in front of you. Okay. And you define the risk, and you do a trade. Uh, Today is a good example of uh, all the fractals uh, appearing very quickly. Hank Wardicki, signing off.